Good morning, this is Neil Casey. In Zoe Mills with the announcements for Monday, May 23rd, 2011. The German Student Exchange Program will be holding an Applebee's Flapjack fundraiser on Sunday, May 29th from 8 to 10 a.m. at the Applebee's on McDade Boulevard in Folsom. The cost is $7 for adults and $5 for children under 12. See Air Donovan in room 229 to reserve your spot now. There will be a mandatory dance team meeting on Wednesday, June 1st. Please report to room 231 right after school. Attention juniors, if you would like to complete your senior project early, the Prospect Park 4th of July committee is looking for volunteers to help with the 4th of July celebration in Park Square. If interested, please see Mrs. Kloss in receiving for more information. In other junior related news, our dearly beloved K-Scope team member Frank Furley has not showed up to go on air in over a week. We at K-Scope hope the best for him. And now over to McCarthy with the weather. Hi, this is Sean with the weather. Today will be cloudy with a high of 83. Tonight's low will be 63. The current temperature is 70. The humidity is at 88% and the barometric pressure is at 29.80 and steady. Now over to birthdays. Good morning, this is Zach with the birthdays. The birthdays for today are Sean Boyd, Christopher Long, Brian Van Wick, and Jacqueline Ventura. Happy birthday. Now over to today's headline. This is Will with today's headline. The half a mile wide tornado that hit Joplin, Missouri over the weekend leaves at least 116 dead. It was the nation's deadliest tornado in nearly 60 years. Now back to the news desk. Good morning, this is Zoe. And Neil with some additional announcements. The senior class trip to Pocono Valley Resort on June 6 still has some seats available. You must bring in your money, $55, and permission slip by Thursday, May 26 to Mrs. Black or Miss Poland. Also, the remaining balance of 35 is due May 26 for anyone that deposited $20 for the trip. There will be a very important but brief meeting for all key club members on Wednesday, May 25th. Please stop by the guidance office before you leave to find out information about May function. And now over to Sean and Dean with the sports. Good morning, Anna Bro. This is Sean. And Dean with today's sports. The Phillies were out the Reds 10-3 last night behind Chase Utley's return. Utley went 0 for 5, but it marked the first time the team scored 10 runs since late April. The Lady Bucks beat Haverford 7-3 last night in district playoff game. The Dallas Mavericks won last night. With the win puts them one more win from going to the NBA Finals. That's all for sports today. Now back to the news desk. This is Neil Casey. And Zoe with some final announcements. The next Interboro Blood Drive is May 26th. This blood drive is for Interboro staff members and students only. Please see Mr. Lavery for details. Class of 2013 will be having a very short meeting today at 2.30. Meet in room 213. We will be discussing May function and upcoming deadlines. All juniors attending the class trip to Washington, D.C. must sign up for the bus with Ms. Catino in room 209 no later than 3 p.m. on May 26th or seating will be assigned. Guitar club members and anyone interested in performing during Friday's open mic in the auditorium should stop by room 101 for a brief meeting after school on Thursday. See Mrs. Hunt for details. While the softball team won their playoff game yesterday, the baseball team was not so lucky. Yes, after months of hard work and sacrifice, the boys' baseball team's journey is finally over. But I say at least they still have each other. So I'll leave you with this. A wise woman once said, The risk of love is loss, and the price of loss is grief. But the pain of grief is only a shadow when compared with the pain of never risking love. And now we're to Lejudas with the menu item of the day. <laughs> Good morning, this is Dan with the menu. Today we'll have nachos. Tomorrow, spicy chicken wrap. Now we're to the vocab word. Good morning, this is Sean Phillips with vocab word of the day. Today's word is embrace, to hold in one's arms. For example, there might be nothing more beautiful than a mother embracing a baby in her arms. Now we're to the quote of the day. This is Sarah with the Quote of the Day. James Dean once said, Dream as if you'll live forever, live as if you'll die today. Now over to this day in history. This is Harrison with this day in history. On this day in 1961, the Freedom Riders were arrested in Jackson, Mississippi. Now over to Pointless Trivia. This is JJ with the Pointless Trivia. 
Did you know the match was invented after the handheld cigarette lighter? Now over to entertainment. This is Day at the Entertainment. This week's music releases are... This is Country Music by Brad Paisley. Now back to the news desk. <laughs> 